सब किसे सब किश है तेरा मैं बंदा बै खरीद सच साहिब मेरा सच साहिब मेरा सच साहिब मेरा वाहे गुरु जी का खालसा वाहे गुरु जी की फतेह वाट अ ब्यूटिफुल शब्द वी विल लिसनिंग टू मै बंदा बैक रीड सच साहिब मेरा फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वेलकम एवरीवन टू दिस ब्यूटिफुल इवनिंग ऑफ आवर जॉय कीर्तन एंड ब्लेसिंग्स एज़ वी कम टुगेदर टू लर्न मोर अबाउट द होली सेंट्स बिकॉज़ मै बंदा इट मींस आई एम लाइक अ स्लेव बैक रीड यू हैव परचेज्ड मी ओ गॉड आई एम योर स्लेव एंड व्हाटएवर यू मेक मी डू आई एम ऑलवेज हियर रेडी टू फॉलो because jio pind sab tis da sab kich hai tera guru ji says oh my god everything belongs to you o lord god vai guru ji sab kich hai tera everything is yours my mind body and soul so once again thank you ji for joining us and for the last few days we have all been discussing tithe sohan panch parwan the whole idea of uh, panch meaning the self elected the self realized saints and how wonderful they sit there with the lord god and what do they do harte avo santo ji sab dukh visaran hara as holy saints let's learn to also meditate on vahiguru ji because all our sorrows will be dispelled and we shall be happy always happy because guru ji says kaam krodh nagar bo parya mil sadhu khandal dahe another beautiful word for the holy saints is sadhu we are filled with all the overflowing angers the sexual desires and we all can break through when when we meet the beautiful holy man the sadhus the saints because kar sadhu anjali pun vadahe greeting holy people the holy saints with our hands put together our palms pressed together it's a great act of merit and guruji says kar dandaut pun vadai raha as we bow at their feet then maybe hopefully um we will also absorb their positive energies and become holy saints ourselves and for that guruji in the next shabad that we study was uh, karo binanti suno mere mita sant tehal ki bela what a beautiful shabad that it is time to serve the holy people as we sing their praises as we also learn more about them we will come to the last line of that shabad in the kirtan swela that nanak das he has sukh mange so if you want to be happy have joy have all kinds of prosperity moko kar santan ki ture and we have understood these shabads and also yesterday we spent quite a bit of time to understand about paire sant jana ki re and let us become the feet of the humble people the hum, humble uh, saints why because sant sabha gur paiye what a beautiful forwards if you want to find my guruji you got to come to the society of holy saints and and then we will be able to find the way mukat padarth ten basically to find the pathway back to liberation now those of you who have missed all these beautiful lectures feel free to reach out to the nice people who have been sending you all this and they will help you to listen to the previous lectures because today we are going to come to a very important topic and everybody who is here tell me if you want this do you want sab sukh anyone yes we all want <laughs> okay today is the weekend it's a saturday for those of you who are here for the live recording and those of you uh, who will be listening to the recording later on maybe it will be a different day but yes during the weekends we all go out there and we want to enjoy life because we want to have sab sukh and guru ji says har ras po gane sant sabha mil gyan so today the key word we're going to focus on is when we come to the yeah. sant sabha when we come to the congregation of holy people we are going to get something called gyan everyone say i love to get spiritual wisdom I love, love to get spiritual. Spiritual. Sanji, beautiful, very good. It's nice to hear so many of you vibrating and understanding together. Let's take turns. Maybe iPhone G. I'm going by alphabetical order. Would you like to read in English? If three, you're feeling much better. 
No, no, no. No, thank okay, you. not yet. No worries. You get well soon. Get well soon. Then uh, the next name I see on the screen is Jesse G. Would you like to read for us? All English comforts or... and yes, all please. comforts, all comforts and peace and the essence of Vaheguruji are enjoyed by acquiring spiritual wisdom in the society of the saints. Yes, beautiful part, Sant Sabha. Yesterday also we spoke about it because we'll meet my Guruji in the Sant Sabha. So today is a continuation. Once I meet my Guruji, he's going to give us Gyan. Say, now I got it. Now I got it. Now you. I got because, it. Yes, because mm. this means I am looking for greater peace in my life. I'm looking for greater comfort in my life. Anyone else wants it? Say me too. Me too. Me too. Correct. Because we all want to learn the path to spiritual wisdom, isn't it? Yes. And that's Gyan. And that's why I think the lesson that we get from this one beautiful line is that finding inner peace and connecting with the divine Vaigriji will lead us to a more fulfilling life. Now, if you feel uh, like sharing something from your life experience or maybe, you know, some beautiful things that have happened in your life, feel free, those of you who are in Zoom and those listening to these in the recordings in YouTube or even Facebook or other social media, please do type your testimony and we will love to hear your stories. Like Miss Sarah has just said, I realized that coming to the University of Sikhism helped me to discover the importance of spiritual wisdom. Yes, Gyan is so important. And through the three-hour coaching, the two days trainings and one-week boot camps, I have learned how to connect with the divine and cultivate inner peace. Oh, Sarah, that's a beautiful way of putting it. And she ends off by saying, I significantly, oh no, this has significantly reduced my stress and emotions improved my overall well-being. Wow! I think today, um, in this modern world, everybody is facing a problem with stress. Am I right? Yes. And yes. we all want to have an improved well-being, don't we? Yeah. Yes. So let's all say together, I'm open to the path of Gyan, spiritual wisdom. I'm open to the path of Gyan, to the spiritual wisdom. Yes, because I think as we connect to the divine Vaigriji and the society of saints, we will experience true peace. We will experience comfort within ourselves. And that's why these beautiful 52 days of journeying that we are coming together, it is so important because it's going to help us by sharing the message of Sikhi and the Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji to empower us to achieve success in both Miri and Piri. Say Miri and Piri are both important. Yes, because Miri is the material world and Piri is our spiritual world. And I'm going to share with you uh, the, the full Shabbat. It is very, 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 very relevant to what we are going through all through our lives. And I think you will all laugh because in this Shabbat, first Guruji, Tantan Sri Gunanak Devji in Sri Rag starts by these beautiful words. Ehe Mano Murak Lobhaya English, please. Maybe Sajid Karji, your turn now. This foolish mind is greedy. Through greed, it becomes even more attached to greed. Wow. <laughs> now, yeah. don't worry. It wasn't talking to you. It was talking to Palji's foolish mind. Because no, we all, all are greedy. Minds are all yeah. our minds. Who said that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, so maybe, do you agree? In this little beautiful pangti, the word greed, yeah. greedy, and greedy is appearing mm. at least three times. Can you see that? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Yeah, so I think you're very right. We are all facing this issue with greed. Because look at the next line. Shabadana pi jai sakta durmat avan jaan. Hanji, Jesse Ji. The evil-minded shaktas, the faithless cynics, are not attuned to the Shabbat. They come and go in reincarnation. 
Yes, because in the second line of this beautiful first paragraph says those evil-minded people who do not want to believe in the Bani, Guru, Guru, hai Bani, which Bani Amrit Sare. The Bani has everything. The Shabad has everything. And Gurbani kahe, whatever the Bani says, Sevak Jan Mane. We are supposed to listen to these teachings and Pratak Guru Nistare. Then we will be freed from the cycle of reincarnation. I'm not sharing that Shabad on screen because you've heard it a lot of times. And yeah. uh, I mean, in essence of time, I'm just going through this beautiful line that Shabad Nabi yeah. Jai means we are not being basically touched by the beautiful love of the Shabad. And that's you know, those group of people are known as the Sakats. They are already following what's called Durmat. Durmat means the, the opposite of Gurmat. Gurmat means the teachings of my Guruji. But Durmat, they are just basically not listening to the teachings of my Guruji. So let me ask you, they are stuck in Avan Jan, which means the cycle of reincarnation. But let's just check with you. How many of you are interested to break free from this cycle of reincarnation? Anyone? Yes, we all want to. We all want to. Yeah. So in this yeah. 52 days, if we could just break free from this cycle of reincarnation, would you say it was worth taking out 52 days from our life? Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Because you all sing very beautifully, both Janam Pichurete Mato and Janam Tumare Leke. And one of the reasons... Hanji, one of the reasons is the greed. So how many of us want to, you know, we struggle with greed and we have attachments to all these worldly possessions. How many of us have this kind of problem? All of us have. All, All of us. us. So look at the third yeah. line of this paragraph. It talks about sadhu. Sadhu is another word for the holy people, the holy saints. Mm -hmm. Sadhu, satguru jemila. Guruji says if we get the blessed opportunity, not only for this 52 days, but forever, to meet my true master, satguru, the true master, then what will happen? We will find the beautiful treasure green is on the beautiful treasure of excellence hanji english please sarjitji one who meets with the holy true guru finds the treasure of excellence Yes, so I think in the very first paragraph of this Shabbat, Guruji is telling us that let's recognize that we are all tormented by greed. Let us learn to overcome greed because then it will lead to a life that's more content, more fulfilling. And how can we do that? Is by meeting a spiritual master called a Sadhu Satgur. And as we follow the teachings, we will not only break free from greed, but we will also break free from this cycle of births and deaths. Would Just you agree? Like that's a good summary. You, Hanji? Just like we have met you, Palji. Ah. To guide us to this path. <laughs> okay. So my job, I think, now is to help you to meet Sadhu Satgur. Say wow. <laughs> Wow. Wow. Because thank you, David. He wrote here some... And anyway, thank you, Auntie Chi. I'm not sure who was it who sh shared whatever you just shared. But it's my yes, pleasure. And uh, Hanji, who's this again? Sarjit. Oh, thank you, Chi, Auntie Chi. But I think yeah. it's my pleasure to be here also every day because this forces me even to study deeper into the beautiful Shabbats. And like I shared the last time, it will take us about 15 and a half to 16 years if every day we just understood one Shabbat of Gurbani. Say wow. 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 So let's pray, oh my God, that you give us this beautiful long life to have that good health to understand all this. Because David just wrote, after that one week boot camp, Palji, I gained a deeper understanding of how greed was impacting my life. Say wow. Wow. And through the teachings and practices that were shared, I learned how to cultivate detachment. Now, is detachment a good virtue, everyone? Yes. Very. Yes. Yeah, so David says, mm. I learned to cultivate detachment and appreciate what I truly have. This has brought me peace and mm. satisfaction. Wow. 100% correct. Hanji? 100% correct. 
Hundred percent correct. Wow, thank yeah. you, David G. Did you hear that? Because David is not on Zoom, and all of them are on Facebook and other channels. That's why they're typing. Thank you for sharing, sir. Let's all say together: We release ourselves from the grip of greed. We relieve ourselves from the grip of greed. And beautifully, can you see with the guidance of Guruji, the power of Shabbat. So in this line, you talk about Sadhu, Satgur. And the previous line, we talked about Shabbat. That's how we will cultivate contentment. I think that is how we will experience true abundance in our life of prosperity and all kinds of good nam tan. Say wow. Wow. So wow. these teachings on overcoming greed, I think, are invaluable. And I thank the University of Sikhism professors for giving us that supportive environment that we can actually, you know, learn how to live a more meaningful life. Is that a good idea? Say yes. Yes. Very. Yeah, because look at the look at the next line. It's it's the Rahau Pangti. It says Manare. Oh my mind. How much should man? English, please. Who's turn, please? Oh, mine, renounce your egotistical pride. Hanji, so we spoke about greed. Now we are talking about guman, which is, you know, home. Because there are five evils, calm, krodh, lobe, mo, ankar. Calm is lust, krodh is anger, lobe is greed, mo is attachment, and ankar is ego. That's where Guruji is now talking about. Oh, my mind, leave your ego behind. Why? And how? Har gur server save tu by doing seva by connecting with my true guruji. Pave darge man, you will be honored in the court of the world and also the court of Vai guruji. Double the bonus, Hanji. English, please. Serve guruji, guruji. No, serve Vai guruji, guruji. Describe as. Scared pool, pool, and you shall be honored in the count of Vaheguru Ji. Wonderful. Vaheguru. That's actually the sacred pool. Matlab Amrit, yes, the sacred yes. pool. Um, and we will be honored in the court of Vaigruji. Yes, it says two things. Can you say serve Vaigruji and also Guruji? Because here the word Har means Vaigruji, Gur means the Guruji. And once we do that in that beautiful service in the sacred pool, the Amrit Naam, when we chant it, so one of the way to do seva is to always chant the name of the Lord all the time. Say wow. Wow. So we just learned another definition of the word save. Save service means by just chanting and reciting always the name of the Lord God. Because the next paragraph is going to make us cry. Uh, but before that, let us just do something very simple. And that's called chant the name. Is that fair? Yes, 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 because when we chant the name, everyone say together, Ram Nam Jap Din Sarat, 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 Guru Mukhar Tan Jaan, Guru Mukhar Tan Jaan, Guru Mukhar English, please, then we'll understand this in deeper, deeper, deeper ways. Chant the name of Vahiguruji day and night, become Gurmukha and know the wealth of Vahiguruji. Wow. Yeah. So when we talk about greed earlier, we were going after the wealth of the world. But here we are going to talk about wealth of Vahaguruji's Nam. Mm -hmm. So the only way to get it is chant, chant, Ram Nam Jap, Ram Nam Jap. But the question is how often and when? Day. Yes, day and night, dinas rath. And then we will become what's called Gurmukha. Say wow. 
Wow. And we will then have the Har Tanajan. And Guruji says, I guarantee you, Sab Sukh Har That's where we started. Yeah. Everybody sit together. Sab Sukh Har Sab Sukh Har Everybody say now all comforts and peace are coming to me. Now oh, all comforts are coming to me. coming to me. Yes, yes, because we are singing and enjoying the essence of Vai Guruji. Go ahead. Essence of Vai Guruji, yes. Anji, and we enjoy this. Say, yes, we enjoy acquiring spiritual wisdom. Yes, we enjoy the acquiring spiritual wisdom. And we can do that in the... Society of Saints. And we can do it in the Society of Saints. So I think here Guruji is telling us to live a life of honesty. Don't be greedy. Have integrity. You know, have uh, an understanding that all the Ill, whatever we do, the karam in our life will have an impact. Our actions will always have a reaction. And if we live a truthful life, day and night we chant the name of the Lord God. We connect with the Guruji's Gyan. We come to the society of the saints. Then what's going to happen? We'll have a life of peace. Our mind will be peaceful and we can avoid suffering because this key word, sab sok, all comforts and peace will come to us. Let's all say thank you, Vaigruji. Thank you, Vaigruji. Hanji, because Mariaji just wrote in the chat that I learned to understand the importance of living life with integrity. I learned how negativity and dishonesty because of my greed can create obstacles on my spiritual path. Today, I focus on truthfulness, on kindness, and I've experienced a greater sense of purpose and peace in my life. Sabasuk. Thank you, Maria Ji. Two magical words. Everyone say Sabasuk. Sabasuk. Yes, that's the reward we will get. Because next, Pankti says, Nit Anis Harprab Sevya Satguru Dhyanam. English, please. Day and night, day and night, continually serve Guruji God. The true Guru has given the Nam. Yes, we have been given the most beautiful, precious gift. It is the gift of Nam. And who gave it to us was Satgur, dear Nam. Say thank you, Satgurji. Thank you, Sadhguruji. Because the next line is the one, remember I told you we're going to cry. It's very, 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 very harsh line. It says, Kukar, Kood, Kamaye, Ninda, Pacha, Pachan. Okay, English, please. <laughs> Those who practice falsehood are dogs. Those who slender Guruji shall burn in their own fire. Wow. Oh my God. So we just yeah. spoke about being honest. We spoke about having integrity. Can you see that Guruji says those who practice falsehood are what again? Dogs. Okay, I didn't say it. You know, you said it. So yeah. don't say Haji say kuta. <laughs> but kukar means Haji. Yes, God has given us the... To open up our eyes that we are living in falsehood like dogs, you Papi. see. 
Yes, yeah, puppy. puppy. Someone yeah. says like dogs, falsehood, puppy. Mm. Correct. Cooker yeah. means dogs. Kur means yeah. falsehoods. Kamaiya means we daily earn all this. And then Guru yeah. Ninda Pachai Pachan. People slender Guruji and say, no need, lad. What? You're going to learn from, you know, all these 52 days. Ayya, Guruji yeah. got nothing to teach me, which I didn't learn in school. And when you say yeah. such negative stuff, oh my God. Gurme, Guruji says, then Parme Pula Du Pula means you will always be wandering around in param doubts and lost and confused. You will be beaten up like okay. I don't want to read the English. Please, someone read the English. <laughs> They wonder, lost and confused, deceived by doubt, suffering in terrible pain. The Haan messenger. Ji. The messenger the of death shall beat them to a pulp. Say, I don't want to be beaten up like that. I don't want to be beaten <laughs> up like that. <laughs> I don't want to wander around lost and confused anymore. I don't want to wander oh, around, around lost and confused. confused. Yes, I don't want to be deceived by doubt, Yar. I don't, I don't want, want to be deceived by doubt. By doubt. Yeah. Anji, and enough of suffering in terrible pain. <laughs> in suffering and in yes, pain. what a wake up call from Guruji because the third mm -hmm. line says those who do that are known as manmuk. Say, I mm -hmm. don't want to be a manmuk anymore. I don't, I don't want, want to be a manmuk anymore. Because sukhna paye, they will never get happiness, joy, prosperity, peace of mind. On the mm. other hand, gurmuk, yeah. sukh lubhan. Mm. Say, I want to be a gurmuk. I want, I to, want be to be a Guru. So I have Sukh Luban. Not Luban, Suban. Oh, Suban. I'm so sorry. Thank you, Ji. Thank you, Ji. Thank you, Ji. You see, I saw I'm under stress to perform yeah, your yeah, satsang. Yeah. Very smart. La. I always make mistakes. Thank you. If you see me yeah, making no, any mistakes. We all make mistakes. Yeah, if you see me making any mistakes or reading wrongly, just correct me too because I'm like, hello, once in a while distracted too. So let's say that again. Say sorry, Vaigruchi, for reading the Bani wrongly. Vaigruchi, sorry, Vaigruchi, wrongly. Hanji. Hanji. And Guruji says, Gurmuk Sukh Subhana. Gurmuk Sukh Subhana. While Gurmuks are wondrously joyful. Say thank you, Vaigruji. Thank you, Thank you. So someone read the full English line, please. The self-willed manmuks find no peace, while the gurmuks are wondrously joyful. Yes, yeah, yeah. so uh, let's all just one last time say, Sukhna Paya is not for me. Sukhna is not for me. Not for me. Hanji, but Sukh Subhan is for me. Sukh Subhan. Sukh Subhan is for me. I want to be wondrously joyful. I want to be wondrously joyful. So I better become a Gurmukh. <laughs> I better become a Gurmukh. <laughs> yes, I think so. The summary of this paragraph number three, it's a very harsh language, but Guruji is reminding us and it is so important we wake up. And now maybe we will learn how to live an honest life, a life of integrity and not falsehood because our actions of doing so will bring us peace and contribute to a more positive world all around us. Am I right? Yes. yes. Good. So I think these teachings offer us very valuable guidance because then we can align our actions in the 21st century with the values of Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji to experience true joy and true inner peace. Say, I like that. I like that. So I think these teachings, they focus on the positive outcomes of living and lovingly living a truthful life. Say, now I got it. Now, now, I got it. now I got it. So now we come to the last paragraph in the last eight minutes we have. English, please. In this world, people are engrossed in false pursuits. But in the world hereafter, only the account of your true actions is accepted. Oh my God. Oh. Did you hear that? 
So does yeah. that mean one day I have to answer for everything that I do? Lekha, lekha dena po. Yes, taram rai jab lekha mange kya mukh leke jayenga. Oh my yeah. God, what a beautiful shabad. Taram rai jab lekha mange kya mukh leke jayenga. Paal ji, what kind of face taram rai jab lekha mange. He's going to ask you, you know. And he's going to ask you, Kya mukh leke jayenga? What kind of face have you brought to show me? Taram rai jab lekha mange. Kya mukh leke jayenga? And Guruji says, you know what? Kehat kabir suno resan. We'll also discuss in the future in detail if it is in the within 52 days or if we need to extend it, maybe God will bless us because this is also about Samto. Kehat Kabir Sunore Samto Saad Sangat Tar Jahenga Saad Sangat Tar Jahenga Saad Sangat Tar Jahenga Saad Sangat Tar Jahenga What a beautiful Shabbat. Those of you who have time later, just go and read this. It's by Kabir Ji in the Rag Maru. It means it comes in the very, very, very you know, last 1106th page of Sri Guru Granth Sahib Ji. But it says Ram Simar Pachtaenga Man. Oh my mind, meditate on the name of the Lord, otherwise you will regret it in the end. Papi Jira. Just now somebody said Papi, right? When we were talking about the dogs. Yes. Now, can you yeah. say Papi Jira Lob Karate Lob? Again, he's talking about greed. Aaj kal utha jayenga, Paal Ji. Today or tomorrow, you may be gone. Hello, dug, 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 wake up, Paal Ji. Lala chilage janam gawaya. Just because of greed, you are wasting janam gawaya, your life away. Maya param pulayenga. You are deluded by Maya, Paal Ji. Wake up. Tan jo ban ka garb na ki jay. Don't be proud of your wealth. Don't be proud that you are so young and youthful and young and handsome say because kaakat jo kal jayega one day you will also crumble like a dry paper and that's why guruji says jo jam aaye kes keh patke when they come they grab you by the hair ta din kichna basayega on that day you will not have any power to fight back with those jams because simran pajan they are nahi kini you don't yeah. want to remember Palji, Vaiguruji. You don't want to think of Vaiguruji, Palji. You're not vibrating in meditation. And what a to muk chota khayenga. You don't practice compassion. You shall be beaten up in your face. And Guruji says, Taram rai jab lekha mange. He's going to ask you for your account. Kya muk leke jayenga? What kind of face will you show him, Palji? Wake up now. And that's why it says, Kat Kabir, Sunore Santo. Oh, holy people, you are wonderful saints who have come together. Sad Sangat Tarejahinga. Sad Sangat Tarejahinga. Everybody, Sad Sangat Tarejahinga. Sad Sangat Tarejahinga. So today, Shabbat. The account of only the true actions will be accepted. And in the last two lines, Guruji says something more positive. He says, Har Sajjan Gur Sevada Gur Karani Pardan. English, please. Guruji serves Vaheguruji, his intimate friend. Guruji's actions are supremely exalted. So if Guruji can save his true friend or serve his true friend, why Guruji? Do you think we also should serve our intimate friend, why Guruji? Yes. Yes, we got to do it. So I think this Shabbat ends off on a very beautiful thing. It says life matters. Everyone say life matters. Life matters. And if we live life truthfully, that matters even more. Am I right? Yes. And I think this is an introduction to the concept of karma. Karma. We will talk about it in detail later on. And what the impact of the, our karma, our actions, are not only in this world, but also in the world hereafter. Say, now I got it. 
No, now, exactly. because look at the four words, actions are supremely exalted. Say, now I got it. My now actions, it. let's repeat it together. Say, my actions are supremely exalted. My actions are extremely exalted. So maybe we need to focus on meaningful pursuits in our life. Maybe we need to learn to live righteously from today onwards. Maybe a more fulfilling life will create a positive karmic footprint for us. Say, now I got it. Now I got it. Now, was that a good important lesson today? Say yes. Very, yes. very important. Yes. Wow. Because I think all our actions are supremely exalted. The positive karmic footprint is so important. Wow. Yes. Wow. And the last line. Oh my God. Namina <laughs> Visere. Say wow. Wow. Karim Nishan. English, please. Then we'll sing it together. Oh, Nanak, never forget the Naam, the wow. name of Vaheguruji, the true Vaheguruji, shall bless you with his mark of grace. Yes, we have two more minutes left, but I want to read what Michael G. just wrote in the chat. And I think it's so important. He says, when I came for the three-hour coaching, it opened my eyes to the importance of living a life of purpose. Wow, living a life of purpose. And by understanding the concept of karam, karma, I learned how my actions in this life will impact my future in this life and my life hereafter. Say, wow. 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 And Michael says in the last paragraph, this has inspired me to make choices that align with the values of Gurbani. And I now contribute positively to the world. Say, we all also want to do the same. We all we also want to want do the same. Hanji, and so maybe let's end off in the last two minutes by saying, I choose to live a life of purpose. I choose to live a life of purpose. I choose to live a life of integrity. I choose a life of integrity. Yes, because my actions create positive ripple effects. My actions create positive ripple effects. And I leave a legacy of good. And, and I leave a legacy, a legacy of good. Not only in this world, but the world hereafter. Not, Not only in this world, world, but the world after this. So let's all have subsuk. When we do Namena Visere, 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 Karam Sachani Karam Sachani Karam Sachani Sachani and Nana Kanamana Visare Karam Sachanishana. Once we do that, then Sabasuk 